look how beautiful the clouds. Hospital and the cancer clinic is in the back. This is my husband. So I'm here now in the cancer clinic. So this will be the fifth cycle. The start of the fifth cycle of my Taxol chemotherapy. That's what it looks like. Just gonna say, oh my god, what is that mommy? <laughs> this is the cold spray. Yeah, that feels good. When you scratch it like that. <laughs> it's nice cleaning stuff. <laughs> God is gonna take a blood. Yeah. Like, why do you say you have more Yeah, right. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna flush it. Some new blood come back. Good. Okay. Just making sure it's behaving itself. I think my blood is still sleeping. I know. You want to put your head what? up a little bit? Turn it to the side. So we have blood return. We just don't have enough to get your blood yet. Got it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Flush. Already. Did I get your room yet? So they already draw blood. So this is the start of my fifth cycle of my taxol chemotherapy. So I'm not feeling well today. I have a dry cough. But I took some tests yesterday and it's negative, so I'm negative for COVID. 
and I'm hoping that um, everything went smoothly this week because having cough and then chemotherapy it's gonna be difficult for me to handle with but I'm hoping and praying everything goes smoothly this week so I will keep you posted guys so we just started So my chemo just finished and I'm here in the lobby. I'm waiting for my husband to pick me up. So everything went smoothly. I fell asleep because I took um, two Benadryl. It's part of the procedure that I need to have I need to take Benadryl I cannot have the IV Benadryl because I have a severe allergy reaction on that uh, when they put a Benadryl before I had a shortness of breath and then um, my body felt so hot so since then I need to take two Benadryl the moment I arrive in the hospital so everything went smoothly and on april 15th that's gonna be my colonoscopy so my surgeon ordered a colonoscopy to check if there is no new tumor in my colon because last year uh, when they did a colonoscopy they found out that there is a tumor on my colon in which is part of the breast cancer that went down on my colon so we're hoping that the uh, coming colonoscopy goes smoothly and everything is in good shape so i'm going to show you guys how i put my wig so i'm losing my hair because i'm on cancer treatment i'm on chemotherapy so first i'm gonna put the hernet making sure the other hair is inside doesn't need to be perfect After that, this is my wig. This is from the foundation. They gave it to me. Then I will just pull it in the back. Lining up in the side. Pulling a little bit. And that's it. It's all set. Got my hair. 